abbiamo organizzato questo evento per cercare di promuovere la candidatura di Julian Assange per il premio Sakharov. Voi sapete che il premio Sakharov viene dato dal Parlamento europeo per la libertà di espressione e la difesa dei diritti umani. Io credo che Assange abbia lottato molto e stia pagando molto caro il fatto di eh, aver scoperto eh, e aver rivelato la verità sull'abuso dei diritti umani che ci sono stati nelle guerre e eh, stia pagando carissimo il fatto di aver reso pubblici questi documenti. Quindi credo che Assange sia il miglior candidato e siamo qui per questo. I'm incredibly grateful for Julian's nomination for the Sakharov Prize this year. Uh, it's a recognition of Julian's work. He has worked tirelessly all his life for freedom of expression and to ensure that freedom of the press is a reality that can bring accountability and that human rights violations can be exposed and that accountability can be brought against governments who commit crimes. He is now suffering the, con the consequences and the message that is being sent is that governments can commit crimes with impunity and they can imp imprison journalists in the West as well. Uh, this is a political case. The outcome is political. It depends on the political environment, on the public's understanding that this is a political case, that Julian is a political prisoner, that he's being persecuted for having uh, exposed a very powerful government committing crimes. And uh, uh, nominations and, and awards like the Sakharov Prize is protective. And in Julian's case, can actually save his life because Julian's life is at stake. There is no public interest defense. Julian is not a US citizen. He is being prosecuted um, extraterritorially. The US is reaching into the, in, into the European um, uh, space in order to um, pursue a publisher who was just doing his job. Um, and in fact, the United States is saying that because Julian is not a US citizen, because he is a foreigner, he does not have constitutional rights. So this case is so outrageous from beginning to end. It is a show of force in which uh, the law is being abused in order to persecute a person and keep him imprisoned indefinitely.